patients who require the services of an ambulance in emergency cases in the Citra, a front plains district of the Ashanti region, resort to commercial motorbikes to get to hospitals. Health officials say the setback is causing preventable deaths. Here's a report by Ibrahim Abubakar. She's deprived districts with no district health facility. The over 34,000 residents here rely on the St. Vincent Clinic and Drobonso for health care services. Emergency cases are referred to the Agogo Presby Hospital or the Akonfo Anochi Teaching Hospital in Kumasi. These two facilities are over 60 kilometers away from Drobonso. The entire district has no ambulance station to deal with emergency cases. An improvised ambulance, which used to transport patients from the satellite communities, has broken down. On Friday, November 22, a pregnant woman who required emergency care at the Akoko Hospital lost her life due to delay in transporting her. They referred the case 6 a.m. They couldn't get any vehicle. They went to the station to high uh, or to rent a vehicle, but they couldn't get. They reached there, I think it was getting to 12 uh, in the afternoon, and the, the, the case just passed out. Some residents share their frustrations. If there is a case and you have to be transferred or referred, you have to go for a vehicle, which costs a lot. So if we are able to get an ambulance, it can help us a lot. You need ambulance back or crowd. And you say, yeah, pa bunch or say ambulance now to tell go on. Yeah, panachawa on the oma y mu bakope. We are appealing to government to get an ambulance for the district. Francois, he bet me didn't do wa em fa or how be a emily obian. This etra from Plains District Director of Health Services, Doctor of Usukwabi Nasa said they are efforts to get an ambulance for the district. It is not every condition that can be a motorbike or bike, but because you don't have, the people are forced to. This year, when the president came here, it was discussed with the data general. He promised that they will provide us a polyclinic. That one, it will go with the ambulance. But until an ambulance is provided for the district, patients in dire need of emergency medical services will continue to rely on motorbikes and public transport.